Wait, let me just put this here. And what's up, peeps? Welcome back to my channel, JR here. Yes, today we are going to review FNN's Tetare. Wait, Ori. Yes, apparently it says here 100% weight. Let me just 100% mama taste. Yes, for those that don't know Tetare, I don't know where have you been living. You guys, if have been living in Malaysia, you guys should know what's Tetare and you know how I, a good Tetare should taste like. And I don't know, apparently this one should, I guess, taste like that tetare, that familiar tetare taste where you can get from mama stores mm. oh i just wait, wait, wait let me let me just let me just ah because i saw this can you guys see it's like you should shake it and then like foam it and somehow this is how you should drink it and i guess i should mm. oh by the way i just took this out from the fridge so it's actually quite cold and i got this from my news and this one is also surf coal and they put it in the freezer so yeah Ooh. smell <laughs> smells very plasticky plasticky i guess it's the bottle smell okay never mind Ooh. where's the foam there's no foam I did try to shake, but there's no foam. Okay, never mind. I'll keep some for my sister. Hmm. Okay. Even in this cup, the smell is not pleasant. I don't know why. Okay, let's try. Hmm. Hmm. It is very milky. It's more towards the milky side. I would say if the ratio, you know, out of ten, right? I would say six, six being milky and four being te. So it's like more towards the milky side. And also, surprisingly, it's not that sweet, which is good because I don't know, I don't know how many people out there that actually likes too much of a sweet stuff. But then this one is, the sweetness is actually good. Hmm, mm. not bad though, not bad, not bad. But you know, so they claim that it is hundred percent mama taste. Well, if you've been to Mama, okay, maybe now, you know, with the pandemic and all that, you cannot technically go in, go to your favorite Mama, but then you still can take away. Then again, being bottled, that's right, right? It actually tastes not bad, I must say. It is definitely not Mama taste, as in the the familiar Teta Red taste that you can get from Mama. It's definitely not that. If you're expecting 100% Teta Red from Mama, that so they claim, it is not. But then it has its own taste and flavor, which is, I would say, you, you should put it in the sense that it comes from a bottle. Well, it being tetare in a bottle, right? I would say it is definitely a very good one. Mm. You know what? I should continue to drink. Wow, it's actually quite good. Mm. Mm. You know what? The more I drink it, you know, I've been drinking like a bit, like a bit already. I would say the, the taste is actually quite balanced. It has that fragrant tea smell. I mean, it's not that strong, but then that tea and the milk actually quite balance out. I don't know. I don't know what happened to my tongue, but then the more I drink it, it's like it's actually quite balanced. And it actually, the more I drink it, actually, the better it gets. I don't know why. <laughs> I guess they have. I don't know. They have. They have made a recipe that it actually suits our Malaysian tongue, which is great. Again, I have to emphasize that it is not mama store taste because you know different mama store use different meal and different day and all that they have different flavors. Hmm, I think I can give my score. I'm gonna give this 4.5. Yes, why not full marks? I've been thinking. Uh, this it is actually a very very good teh tarik drink come that comes from a bottle and I think that what would make it a full score i would think that maybe add a little more tea flavor to it lessen the milk i don't know to me to me at least i would i would feel that more tea flavor will bring up a little bit more um mm, yes would i buy it again i would yes and yes there you go that's my two cents of tetare ori from fnn yes if you guys like my content remember to and thanks for watching i will see you guys in my next video ciao here Oh! Oh! So far!